Faji Medical Foundation. It's a, one of the ways in which we think we can give back to the society. As a medical practitioners, we know that in the grassroots there are a lot of people who, because of one reason or the other, they wouldn't go to the uh, clinic to know their medical status. And a lot of people die out of that. Like today now, quite a number of cases of uh, unknown hypertension and uh, were detected. You know, some of which if were not detected will have they are in, at the breach of uh, you know, complications like stroke. You, know, you see a lot of people walking about the streets and they don't know that they, they have uh, something going on. So this is uh, our initiative to see what we can give back to support government's efforts in improving the health of especially the, um, the less privileged uh, in the society. So we've had some other programs in the past and uh, in the grassroots we have a wellness center where people can walk in to go and check their blood pressure, blood sugar and so on in Big Bora, Paragua Central Local Government. We have a registered nurse there who does that on a regular basis. She's employed to do that. And then we have been picking several, at least for the, the statistics we had, the center was opened in February and by last week, Friday, they had seen up to 240 cases out of which 25% of them had abnormal parameters that were referred to. You know, so we felt that here also in Lagos, the less privileged, Ramoshi, Diaraba, you know, and especially maybe some other people uh, that are participating in the ITICAF, you know, we bring it to them. You know, so it's really been rewarding. I feel very great and fulfilled, alhamdulillah. Um, but we give glory and adoration to Allah for letting today be a success. Um, I wasn't expecting so much turnout, but alhamdulillah, people came out and I'm happy we we're able to help the people that we need and we're able to refer people that needed referral promptly, alhamdulillah. Our family organizes a tour in, in, for people about this period. So we just felt that we should uh, you know, include this in, as part of it. So we are grateful for our donors. A number of people have donated. Uh, in cash and kind to make this happen. We are very grateful to them. We pray that Allah shall grant their hard desires and in this month of Ramadan especially that uh, Allah will reward them immensely. I think this should be done every month. We always tax each other and write to companies. I'm sure some companies will definitely want to fund programs like this. So if we can like get 12 companies, one company funds it every month. And they'll be happy to like every year. And it's sort of also for them also, it's more like a boost and like an advert also for them too. And it helps their image also. And they're also any reward. Yes, to, you know, everyone uh, who think that they are okay but yet they are carrying quite a number of things al around walking on the street and thinking they are fine. It's important that we go for a checkup, regular checkup. And even after, we saw a number of cases too that say, oh, okay, my BP was, somebody picked it up and said it was high, then I think it, it got normal. So that's usually the story where people will take drugs then the BP will come down and after that they stop.